Okay, we're just going to run through through the settings for using the Canon G7X to do night lapses, uh, star night lapses. I've had a couple of people asking questions. So this is what I do with my Canon. So obviously powered it on. You need to uh, select the scene mode. And then you click the top right. I've already got it uh, chosen. You select your scene, star time lapse movie. And once you've selected that, which is that one, it's showing in there, star sort of night lapse. This is on your bottom left for the settings. And the settings that I use for doing. Uh, my night lapses save source images so this would save uh, images to your camera and then you would have to edit them and sort of make them into a movie yourself if you leave it as disabled it'll automatically do it for you and you have a choice of effects I always leave it on shoot without applying movie effects the others are all for different sort of star trails if you want long medium uh, me well, standard medium and a short but as i say i always stay to the uh, shoots without applying movie effects click ok the interval i normally use is 15 seconds it's a trial and error job but i find 15 seconds works a treat your movie record size i normally just shoot leave it in the uh, the full hd unless you have a really big memory card the 4k lapse would probably eat a lot of memory now the shooting time this was from me the other night i had it on unlimited because i'd done it overnight basically it was shoot until the power is exhausted now if you use just the battery it would probably only last depending on the uh, the temperature outside just over a an hour an hour and a half but i use that with a power pack which i'll show in a minute but just for the moment on a night i would either 60 or, or 90 that would give you probably about 10 to 15 seconds of footage now auto exposure on the first shot fixed first frame so whatever you would um going to be shooting the night lapse of you press the shutter release it would automatically choose which is the best sort of light settings um, at the time or you can choose it so each frame as it goes along taking your shots it would uh, adjust to that light now I used that each frame when I was shooting the other night from sunset through to sunrise because obviously sunset it's getting darker and then you do in the night it's darker and then it gets light in the morning and that way each frame was correct in the uh, auto exposure but normally if i'm just shooting at night and it's already pitch black fixed first frame will work fine especially if you're just doing a short 60 to 90 minute duration Remote control, I just leave that. This bottom one I've changed, enable or disable. It would go off every 15 seconds, bleeping. Um, which sort of gets a bit annoying, so I've just disabled that. You know when it's finished because the lens uh, retracts back into the camera. And basically that's all the settings in there. And then once you've got your obviously settings dialed in you would press the shutter release it would give the exposure at the time of what you're taking so if it was pitch black you know you could have a 15 seconds there with the f 1.8 and you probably have a high iso you press the first shot obviously give you an exposure and then what you do is just before you're setting your time you press that one and then you just click on the shutter and that there just shot your first shot 
and every 15 seconds that screen flashes up to say that's another shot taken but you don't get the bleep so any yep here we go so that's your second shot gone in so you get four shots over a minute but you need to be shooting for at least an hour to get as I say about 10 to 15 seconds of footage and if you want to stop at any time just press that you can review your image but obviously it's not very long so I hope this has uh, helped anybody with the G7X who wants to take uh, night lapses really easy to use you know for a little camera it does take some great uh, night lapse photography I'll put a few clips on that I've taken over uh, the last few months on sort of camping that I've been doing or just overnight catching the uh, sunset and the sunrise I will show now just using the uh, power bank okay so here's the uh, the power bank that I use obviously that's just a sticker mine's a tech net now it's a this is a power delivery type power bank So you just pop that into the top, power it on, and you'll notice that the uh, the battery is shown as blank. That's because the power bank is now supplying the power to the camera. So whatever power you've got into your, in your power bank is how long you can take a shot i mean i use this one the other night i've used it two or three times without having to charge it and i've had basically if i set it up at sunset so say about nine o'clock at night it'll run right through till about sort of six in the morning you get it normally runs for just over eight hours and it'll just shut itself down but it's ideal for taking uh, a shot like that so yeah that's one good way because it's as you say, it's fine for taking a picture, a night lapse, which is only going to last about an hour. But if you want anything longer, you need to use a power bank and it needs to be a power delivery type one. I'll put a link to this one that I use. Um, and this really does help. I have a longer cable than this. This one's okay just for showing this, but uh, normally when it's set up on a tripod, I have a couple of elastic bands around this and I just attach it to my uh, tripod leg and that uh, suffices but if you were leaving it out overnight you've got to remember the camera's not waterproof I normally set it up in our loft which has a velux window so it's usually on the inside of the velux um, to a suction pad and I can catch uh, night shots with that way but if you put it out you'd have to put some kind of plastic bag over it or something and just leave a little hole out where your uh, where the lens comes out and put some sort of elastic bands around it just to keep it in place but uh, so I hope this helps using a power bank taking night lapses thanks for watching mm -hmm.